What is everyone? This is Harvey at geek to diy and uh, in this video I'd like to just go over to you a new item that I got for my car and used for my cell phone. It is a air vent swivel clip that I bought from Micro Center. It fits phones up to five and a half inches wide and uh, I got this because I used to have an iBolt uh, phone holder that would sit on the um, suction cup on the uh, windshield and unfortunately I've had it for two years and it broke <laughs> that part that holds down uh, the phone lasted from my Galaxy S3 to the Pixel um, so it's just um, just about four years old and finally the top piece uh, finally gave way so I needed something uh, new and decided to try instead of some instead of a uh, phone holder that goes to the windshield because it is kind of weird when you put the heater on it doesn't always clean that spot up takes a little while to do that one I wanted to try one on the vent see how that felt and it was in micro center one day and found this one to look really cool um, and it looks like it's going to hold the phone well and it was only about uh, just a few bucks whereas the other uh, one from iBolt was much more expensive so I think the advantages of this one over um, the one I had previously was one it's on the air vent so it doesn't stay on the windshield and this one is a little easier to swivel and kind of hold in place where the other one uh, that one I had wasn't, wasn't so um, so easy uh, so here we have it so when we when we put your phone in it's spring loaded and, it, and holds up in there it has a nice wide grip um, for the phone itself and then the base unlike some of them they're like flimsy and grab it by a couple of pieces has a slightly harder and heavier looking clip that grabs onto the vent like I said, you can take it and twist it and and hold it to one way so it stays uh, towards you, or excuse me, stays upright. And another one that stays uh, landscape. And like I say, you can twist it a little bit so it points towards you or like points towards the back of the car, points towards the, the passenger. And here we have a good look of what the spring looks like for it. Um, so like I said, it fits up to phones that are five, uh, five and a half inches. And if you notice, the spring moves out to one side. So kind of when you put it in, look to see whether you want the phone to move more towards the left or to move more towards the right. Because um, that's going to be important, I guess, where, where you position it in. I mean, do you want to really put it over top of the vent and uh, when it sits in there, it covers more of the radio? Or do you want it to shift off to the side? And so forth and it also comes into play instead of you just putting it in portrait mode you put it in landscape mode it was really smooth to open it up and put it uh, put the phone in there and the, the outside of the clips kind of like curve in almost like um, your hands holding it from the very end have you take your fingers and pull your fingers in a little bit so instead of it being just flush where something's gonna just squeeze in and hold it uh, as a little jostle in a car it's not just gonna pop out and uh, fall out of the holder for you. I looked at several of them that look kind of cheaply made and you have just a little bit of plastic and a tight little uh, spring or something like that and this one didn't quite look like that. It has a bigger base uh, for the phone itself and you see how tall it is the size that hold the phone in that matter um, and the spring clip is not loose but also not that tight. And when you put the phone in there it feels like it's going to hold it and uh, not let it go. The other thing you'll notice that on, uh, unlike some of the ones that I saw, again a little bit of comparison shopping that I was doing first, is that uh, the connection between the part that holds the phone and the part that goes onto the vent isn't just something that's sitting on there and uh, like factory tight or something like that. You have it where you can adjust it and you can uh, either set the phone a little to the left, a little to the right because it's got kind of a ball joint in there that kind of uh, squeezes it in tight. Negative that I found on this is that if you're going to change your phone from portrait to landscape, unless you leave it a little loose, you have to go and adjust that. So keep that in mind when you're setting it up. Then the portion that goes connected into the vent has a nice little bump to it. So uh, if you need to go flat because of the way your vent is, you can take that little piece in the back of that blue strip and put it towards the bottom. If you have space and you want it to just to hold it down because you don't put too much pressure on that vent piece, you can leave that little blue piece in the back 
up higher and it'll still hold your phone. So you don't have to put it on the top part of the vent or the lower part of the vent. I myself have it on the lower part um, with that piece grabbing onto the vent and then that circular part right next to my thumb um, sitting on the, the base plastic of the vent. I'll just talk about what it is. Let's see it in the car. So here I am in the car and I've installed it. I put it, uh, initially I put it uh, to the left of the vent so you can see where, the, um, uh, where it's at. And it's not that far. I didn't want to be covering up too much of the radio. All right. And I also left the um, adjustable part to push off to one side. As time progressed, i kind of still been kind of moving it around. And one thing to note, because of the way it hangs onto the vent very tightly, um, it says on there you can just push it on there. I used a screwdriver just to open up the jaw for it to grab onto the vent and not put too much pressure on the vent itself. It has a lot of adjustability and most importantly it feels sturdy when it's holding the phone. It doesn't feel like it's going to fall apart. So seeing it on here really doesn't do it much justice without seeing a phone on there. But I was so excited just to grab a video of it installed on there let you know how easy it was. It took me all of uh, five minutes to take it out of the box, look at the instructions. Um, it took me longer to get a screwdriver just to uh, push it up there and hold it. And um, now I'll wind up adjusting it and just playing with it and say, um, do I want to use it um, when it's portrait or do I want to use it landscape? But I find myself more often using it um, in portrait mode than landscape mode. It also covers the vent less. And there you have it. This That's a quick look at the Aduro swivel mount car cell phone clip um, that I purchased at Micro Center to replace an iBolt uh, cell phone holder in, in my car. I hope this video was informative and gave you a um, good idea of what this looks like and the ease of being able to put it in. I'd also like to say thank you for watching. Um, please subscribe to my channel for future videos. If there's something that you'd like to see or may clarify on it, just shoot me an email or comment and I'll get back to you as soon as I can.